<sighs> and so it is time to descend. I'm not actually sure which way I'm supposed to go. There's that way and that way. Wait. I'm gonna guess it's over here because this one's got the elevator. The other one hasn't returned yet, which is understandable. You know, the further down we go, the scareder I get. Because one, this doesn't feel safe. And two, everything gets creepier the further down you go. Which is why I never like going down. Light and oxygen. Well, we Keep those two main plateaus. Is that even possible? If there's some kind of afterlife. Do they think my place is taken? The real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? Or what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? There's someone up there who call me an imposter. It's dumb luck, right? I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right sign. Christ! This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Please say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? still be alone no friends no family you could make new friends i'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler 
If not, you still have. That's nice. Catherine? Yeah? Hello, Catherine. Well, what happened? Power's out. I don't think she can talk. Listen. I hate opening. There we go. Aha. Hey, I know it's not much, but why don't we stop moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Ooh. Comforting. It will hold. Look at all the glowy fish. Um, what am I doing? Uh, do I just sit back down? Does, does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes, but generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like... It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler sent a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Oh god. Catherine, things are getting a little hard to see. Do not move. You did it! Excuse me, Ross. <laughs> oh no. This... this cannot be good, right? <sighs> Approaching. Oh, good, you're back. What happened? Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. It spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. It said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. It was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. I'm glad it didn't. Yeah, me too. It wants something from me. It wants me to do something. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good, not sure the climber can take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. <coughs> I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. I think the other you has been here. We're following your footsteps, Kat. When I have footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere. Technically. Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for Tower and find that arc. Yeah, what if you are still alive? I mean, I don't know how long ago this started happening. Alright, ooh, god, I don't like it here. It is offline. Hmm. Oof. I don't like it down here. Ugh. Oh god, what am I stuck on? Okay. It's really hard to see. Error. Blue mark, link needed to call climber. Mm-hmm. 
Stay close to the lights. Okay, I'm here. Check. Tower evacuation failed. Meaning arc to fi. Nothing else I can do. Alright. Stay close to the light. Boy, do I not like it. Oh, it's so hard to see. Tao? Come in, Tao. Please answer, Tao. That 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 will do it. What's this do? Oh yeah, we gotta stay close to the lights. Oh look at that, it's an eel. Think. So we guys. So yeah, okay, lights. Safety of light. Okay. <coughs> Warning. Strong torrents expected. Okay. But what else do I do? Like anything. Okay. Hmm. Alright. That will do it. Huh. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the world is out of control. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell them yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! The light is over there! Final push for us. Almost there. We just. Oh, oh, Do I really want to be down here? I I am gonna assume no. So shh.
Follow the lights. When you're lost in the dark, look for the light. the lights off and broke it. Walk, huh? Catherine, we need to discuss your definition of short walk. And about how dangerous it is down here. Oh, it's getting rough. Oh, that. Oh god. 
anybody in here? No? Was this kind of like a little safety place? I don't think so. This is Tau. Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of Theta calling. I got a team with me and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen, we're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward and the wildlife you got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. The instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as soon as possible. Stick to the lights. The critter should leave you alone. All right, you heard the man. We're moving out, people. Tao, keep the doors unlocked. We're coming in. Yeah, that was a perfect idea. I mean, <laughs> really gets you places, doesn't it? We're gonna die here. I just know 